Hi guys, welcome to The Savera. This is your health coach Jennifer and you're watching Fit with Jen. The Savera is bringing to you a brand new fitness challenge, Daily Yoga. Daily yoga is a very special challenge because almost anyone can do it. You don't need any prior expertise or training. You don't need any fancy equipment and you can do it from the convenience of your home. So what are you waiting for? Excuses are not going to work. Let's get started. Hi guys, welcome to the Savera Times. This is your health coach Jennifer and you're watching Fit with Jen. Welcome to a brand new episode of my favorite challenge, Daily Yoga. Daily Yoga is a very special challenge because not only do you not need any previous training or expertise to attempt these exercises, you also don't need any fancy equipment. And best of all, you can do it from the comfort of your house. So what are you waiting for? All you need is a little bit of time, motivation and a yoga mat. Let's get started with today's session. Today's session is primarily focused on breath work, which is pranayam. Why pranayam? Pranayam because pranayam helps to improve the oxygen saturation in your blood and also improves the overall lung capacity and breathing is life. So there's a couple of things to keep in mind before we begin today's session. Number one would be your position. You can sit in Vajrasana like me with your legs folded underneath you. You can cross your legs in front of you like in Sukhasana. You can also sit on a chair with your legs, uh, uh, with your feet touching the ground as long as your spine is straight, your shoulders are relaxed and your neck is in alignment with your spine. So no slouching, make sure you're sitting straight and attentive. Once you've attained a good and comfortable position, try and maintain that position throughout the practice because unnecessarily fidgeting with your position and changing it can be quite distracting. The second thing to keep in mind is the duration. Today we will be doing a total of six exercises and all of them would be for about four to five minutes each. So make sure that if you get tired or out of breath, simply stop the exercise, resume normal breathing, and you can come back to the exercise as soon as you're able to. So these are the only things to keep in mind for today's session. Let's get started with our very first exercise, the alternate nostril breathing. You're gonna breathe in from the left by blocking the right, breathe out from the right. Breathe in from the right and out from the left, in from the left and out from the right. Let's practice it for four to five minutes.
and change. Let's move on to our second exercise for today. It is uh, the Kapal Bhati Pranayam, also known as Fire Breath, popularly known as the King of All Pranayams. It is called the King of All Pranayams because of the number of ailments it helps to relieve. So please make sure that you inculcate it in your daily lives. How to do it? You take a deep breath in uh, through your nose and when you breathe out, you will contract your stomach, push the air out forcibly through your lungs. So inhalation is normal, exhalation is forceful. So let's practice it for four to five minutes.
and change. Let's move on to our exercise number three. It is called the left nostril breathing. As the name suggests, you will block your light right nostril. Breathe in and out only from the left side. Let's practice it for four to five minutes.
hand change. Moving on to our exercise number four, it is the exact opposite. It is the right nostril breathing. You will block the left nostril and breathe in and out only from the right side. Let's practice it for four to five minutes. and change let's move on to exercise number five it is called the brahmari pranayam the humming bee pranayam take your index fingers place them on top of your brows three fingers to close the eyes and your thumbs to block your ears deep breath in and hum as you breathe out
Moving on to our last and final exercise for today, it is Om Chanting. Take a deep breath in through the nose, chant Om as you breathe out.
And keeping your eyes closed, let's chant the Mahamartanje Mantra. Go ahead and repeat the words after me. Om Triambakam Yajamahe Sugandhin Pushti Vardhanam Murvaru Mevabandhana Mrityor Mokshi Mamrata Rubbing your hands together, placing them on your eyes, on your ears, and your heart. So guys, this was the session for today. I'm hoping that you enjoyed it as much as I did. Please do stay consistent if you want to see consistent results. You can follow us on all social media to stay updated with more such cutting edge fitness challenges. That is it for today. Stay tuned until next time.